Community News. Hi, here we are at the Santa Cruz County Animal Shelter with our pet of the week. Open door, open heart. Come on down and visit us. So this is Jay. He's a four-month-old orange tabby kitten. When you look at the card on his condo, it says the reason he was brought to us was that there were too many in the household, so his owner surrendered him to us. Too much of a good thing, that's what overpopulation is. So here at the Santa Cruz County Animal Shelter, all of our pets who are adopted go home already spay-neutered, our cats, our dogs, and our rabbits, so we can combat our overpopulation problem and have fewer homeless pets in the future. Welcome to the Animal Shelter, everybody. This is Jay, he's our kitten of the week. He's purring up a storm and he's ready to play. If you're looking for a new friend, an active kitten, Jay might just be your guy. You can find pictures of Jay and other animals at the shelter at scanimalshelter.org. Come on down. They're all ready to meet you. You got that right, Jan. Hope Services. Amazing. 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 Santa Cruz Community Farmers Markets Food of the Week. I'm Jennifer, and I've known Violet for a long time. How long has my mother known you? I met your mom when I was about two or three days old. A long time. I have had one of, of your bags for how, for a long time. Uh, yeah, you have. Um, I believe it's a, um, a fairy bag, Tinkerbell. I remember when I made it for you. Can you tell us about your business here? Um, I'm at the farmer's market here the last Wednesday of the month. Um, I've been, I, we started off making just bags uh, because when I went to the grocery store, I had one of the cloth bags from the store and it had a bunch of canned goods and eggs were on top and the handle broke and the eggs went everywhere. My mom used to be a professional seamstress so she said we could make a better bag so our business is the better bag. And um, when I was, um, I've been going to different places to try to sell and when I was at Earth Day in downtown Santa Cruz, I met the guy next door here and he got me a spot here. And it was suggested that I make uh, pot holders. So we started making pot holders and then people wanted aprons to go with the pot holders. Now, my best seller is aprons and pot holders, although I do sell a lot of bags too. When did you start? I started about five years ago. I've been here at the farmer's market mm, about a year and a half. So this is my permanent spot for the last Wednesday of the month, but I do go to the fairs, festivals, craft shows. What is your best seller? I have two best sellers, and my uh, bags, the uh, peacock bag, and then the apron is the peacock apron that has the same peacock on it. Are there different styles? I make all different si styles and all different sizes. All the bags are of all the same price. They're all $25. They're all lined in denim, which is blue jean material. All of my handles are reinforced, so we will guarantee that this will hold 25 pounds and it will not break. Our phone number is on all of our stuff. So if there is ever a problem, you just call us. Because it's cloth that goes through the washer and dryer, and because it's lined in denim, they are reversible. When is your busiest time of year? In November and December. Thank you for the interview. Thank you, Jennifer. Santa Cruz Community Farmers Markets offers organic foods, vegetables, fruits, eggs, cheese, pasture-raised meats, as well as artisan ready-to-eat meals from local chefs. We have three year-round markets, downtown, west side, and Live Oak, as well as two seasonal markets in Scotts Valley and Felton. Learn more at www.santacruzfarmersmarket.org.